uh, between 7 and 8 o'clock. They'll see partly sunny sky, cool temperatures, but you know, 52 to 56 normal highs should be about 47. So uh, another mild start to the day. Charlottesville, good morning again. You're 57 right now, 61 in Orange and in Louisa. Dillon seeing 60 degrees right now. Harrisonburg, 57 degrees there again. We hit 72 here in town yesterday. We're trending about five degrees warmer in and around the Charlottesville area compared to just 24 hours ago. Philly, 25 degrees warmer there. Uh, you look to the west and you can see some of the colder air that's now starting to filter in behind that cold front that will be moving through the area today. And our winds will be shifting and coming out of the north and uh, that colder air will start to head eastbound. So temperatures will be much cooler this weekend, uh, pretty close to seasonal levels. Right now, again, we're picking up a southerly wind. Once the front moves through, those winds will start to shift during the day today and become more northerly. Here's a live look at Doppler radar. All is quiet. The front should come through mainly dry for our area. I think there'll be a few showers in the southeastern part of the state, but we'll see dry conditions with that mix of clouds and sunshine. And as I mentioned, those winds will be shifting coming out of the north and it gradually will start to bring in some of the colder air. By tonight, you'll feel the difference. Temperatures tonight will be generally in the 30s. Uh, of course, daytime highs today still expected to be above normal. Generally, most areas will be in the lower to middle 60s. Stage is still set. For a dry day on Saturday, pretty pleasant conditions. And then Sunday, there'll be an area of low pressure tracking off to our east or riding along that cold front. And we're going to be on the northern fringe of some of that uh, precipitation. And we'll see some snow showers develop in the pre-dawn hours of early Sunday morning before changing over to all rain during the day. Uh, still, again, not expected to see much accumulation east of the Blue Ridge Mountains. There may be some pockets of about an inch or so across the uh, Shenandoah Valley. Most of that will accumulate on grassy areas, untreated surfaces. So you want to be careful, especially early Sunday morning if you're thinking about heading out to a worship services. Now you head further south and west. We're talking about from Roanoke into southwestern Virginia. They could see six to eight inches of snow there. So, you know, it's a pretty close call, but I think most of the accumulating snow right now will be off to our south and west. And we'll keep you updated on this as it continues to evolve. In the meantime, we are expected to see that the cold rain during the day on Sunday as well. We could see upwards to a half inch, maybe three quarters of an inch of rain. So here we go. Mix of clouds this Sunday day, breezy, still mild, 60 for the valley, 64 Central Virginia. Westerly winds at about 10 to 15 miles an hour. And then for tonight, mostly cloudy, cold. That cold air starts to settle in. 32 to 36 will be our overnight low. And nice day for Saturday. Partly sunny, pleasant, but much cooler. 48 for the valley and about 52 for Central Virginia. Here's your seven-day forecast. That mix changing over to a cold rain on Sunday. We'll get up to 42 and then it's out of here for Monday. We start to warm back up. Sunny 57. Valentine's Day, mostly sunny.